We'll take a quick look at the um, BC244 electromagnetic door hold open device. So we, we get a lot of um, a lot of questions here for um, for people who are trying to comply with fire safety standards by holding open doors along corridors and, and that type of thing. But they need the door to close in the event of a, a fire alarm. So generally a, a door would have a door closer unit on it. And this is the, the magnetic unit that goes onto the wall with the retainer plate that um, that uh, allows you to hold the door open. So this, these units come complete here with more or less um, everything you need in, in, in terms of the holder. So we've the, the back box that gets um, fixed to the wall, um, or I'll show you the, the floor mounting option now in a second, if, if that's what you require. So we have the, um, the back box there, the two knockouts for the pressed release button. So um, that's also an option. We knock these out and we fit the pressed release button. In, in, into that if, if you need it. Um, the holder itself <coughs> is a, a 24 volt holder and it's a simple termination it's just pause and neg from your power supply unit so I'll show you the power supply now in a second and then this clips onto your um, pressed release button and it goes into your your back box if you need it so there's that. Inside the box you also get um, two glands for, for terminating into it which are your cable in and out and we get the retainer plate, which is um, what gets fitted to the door. So this, this unit goes together, goes in like that. Um, and then the, this fits onto that. And the whole unit gets bolted together, gets gets fixed to the door. Um, and you have the, the uh, rubber that goes in between here to give a little bit of flexibility. So when you've, you've fixed it, um, it's a good, good solid mac match you kind of need most of this plate to fit onto the, the retaining part of it to keep the door held in place to get the securest holding in place so so there's those but the, the box comes with um, everything you need there's the, the bolts and the fixing screws and everything that, that come with it um, if you happen to have one of these that instead of wall mounting you, you may want to floor mount it we do a, a casing we call this the the SBC AV unit, which is effectively a, a floor mount bracket for this unit. So you screw that to the floor with a, a good fixing, and you put your hold open device in there. All the all the um, the holes line up. They're all pre-machined for you, so there, there's no difficulty with that. And then obviously your press the release button gets connected in there. Once you have your your power terminated inside here, so we would generally bring the cables in terminate that and then kind of slide the whole thing in so you have a fair bit of space in here to to kind of tidy up your cables afterwards so your your pressed release goes in into the top of it there and that's your floor mount fixing so um it's very solid it's a very it's a very heavy casing if you want to go into the flooring with it and then as maybe a, a single door solution um we recommend these these are a, a power supply that fits on a, a standard double gang back box It'll take either a, a 24 volt trigger from a fire alarm panel, so you take a, a link from the bell circuit or the sounder circuit, that takes the 24 volts and it tells the relay inside this to, to release the door. Or um, you can actually have it where it, um, it triggers on the release. Or you just break it with a relay, so you give it a normally open, normally closed contact, you tell that contact to change. So that's the, the version where you've just come straight off the relay in the fire panel, or you've come off an I.O. device, this type of thing. So your, your input for your mains fits very neatly on a, a double gang back box. And we find that these are very popular to be mounted just adjacent to the doors that you want to release. And if you have um, if you have somebody who wants to release all the doors at once, they just push this button here, and it's convenient all the doors that are connected to it then. Um, it, it releases the power to them and it, and it lets you know that they're closed so it's a, a nice neat unit this will do um, it's a 250 milliamp power supply so that will do five of these units in terms of its current draw and then if you need something bigger we have we have two amp power supplies which will do you know 20 door holders that type of thing if you have any um, questions on any of these um, give us a call in the office or info at comsec.ie we'd be happy to help you so that's an overview of our, our door holders. Thanks very much.